For me, it's a very important moment. We have been waiting for 18 months to really meet people again. And we're happy that we can host again the Swiss Biotech Days after two years nearly. Oh, we met a lot of, you know, really good contacts, people we already knew. It was easy to kind of get back in touch with them during the pandemic, but meeting new people was really the challenge. And uh, today, you know, it's really delivered. We started a company recently, so uh, being part of this community was really important. Uh, I think early on, you need to meet your customers, your future partners and this is a unique opportunity in the country. The Swiss Biotech Association has been outstanding in really um, listening to the companies, uh, connecting with the new platform, uh, the companies with investors, with the venture platform, identifying problems from the community and uh, making sure that these problems are discussed with the authorities. General, making sure people understand in Switzerland how important this biotech. Switzerland is, uh, from a biotech perspective, it is a powerhouse. You know, sure, it's kind of just only a, a, a tiny, small place, but in terms of academic excellence, in terms of resources, in terms of uh, intellectual curiosity, uh, I think Switzerland um, in, bio, in biotech is a, is, a, is a name to be reckoned with. The quality and the potential that Switzerland has give you motivation to continue and to be stronger as well because we have big competitors in US for investment, in China, so you really want to understand that you can do here, you have the resources here to make it happen. All the large biotech companies still go over to the US for finding leading investors. So that's something which I consider still to be a weakness of Switzerland. But it's absolutely worth investing because we have talents, we have uh, very good programs, we have new science, new technologies. And from that point of view, I think it's everything here. I think the Swiss university landscape is very diverse. So uh, we have students that really do basic science, but also we have a lot of um, talents that are from the more applied sciences um, and they're also spread uh, across Switzerland. And I think this diverse landscape of, of students and, and talents is actually one of the key factors for the success of the biotech industry here in Basel, but also throughout Switzerland. Switzerland itself is a, is a beautiful and, and wonderful country to live in. And this is also highly sought after by many of the talents and transferees moving into Switzerland. Uh, one of the reasons is a very high quality of life. So they know that their families are, they feel happy and they're very comfortable in Switzerland. Scouting here in Switzerland is extremely interesting because it's a relatively small country. You really can visit a lot of and meet a lot of people here, the CEOs, the business development people, and to talk to them again what progress they made and how we can work together and really find the best innovation uh, to bring new medicines to the patients. For meeting uh, innovative biotech companies that are, you know, developing uh, innovative therapies and treatments for, you know, unmet needs um, ranging from oncology to different therapeutic areas. 
I think the science of therapeutics has dramatically changed in the last five to ten years. And all sorts of things have suddenly become possible. There's so much going on, there's so many new ideas, and that's what makes it so exciting coming here, seeing all these bright, bright, new, inspiring ideas. You know, cell therapy, RNA uh, medicines, novel ways of influencing the immune system. It's just extraordinary. Switzerland is a great place to uh, work on AI and ML topics. You have a super test lab. You have companies like Swiss Re. You have companies like Roche, Novartis. You have IT giants like IBM and Google. And you can really test things in the healthcare environment like in very few other places. So what we tried to select this year were companies uh, that were able to uh, generate and develop uh, monoclonal antibodies for uh, ultra-rare disease. We honored the uh, companies uh, that were able to develop and commercially successfully launch uh, new products. We honored companies that were able to deliver innovative medicines and scale them up on a global scale uh, for the treatment of COVID. So I think all these people and entity really delivered something that uh, generated a lot of value in Switzerland, but was helpful outside Switzerland. Switzerland is a country, from my understanding, that fosters a lot of international collaborations. And I think today's event is a perfect example of that. It's been a great mixture of companies, sizes, interest, expertise, uh, which we can definitely take back home and uh, showcase them to our members in Greece and hopefully foster collaborations.